Right, yo, what's up everyone? Project Moto here. Um, today is a little bit different because today is a Sunday and I'm going out for a ride. Um, I'm going up to meet Paul. Deb, I'm on the Monster. Um, had a bit of a choice of what bike to take home and, uh, yep, the Monster one. Such a nice bike. So I'm just going up to meet uh, Paul now. Then we're going to go up and meet his, one of his friends. And then we're going to go and meet some other friends, we're going to go for a ride. So uh, yeah, let's crack on with the video. It's like the monkeys. He's going to be at a tea or something, I think he said. Ah, there he is, because he's on his orange bike. Yo. Yo. See that beach bucket? Yeah, I just come past yeah. with him. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right. What have you been doing? I've only been here five minutes, so I've had two people take photos already. Well, have you or the bike? <laughs> Good. I know you love it. And you bought your bell helmet. I bought the bell helmet. <laughs> with me and the bike and the helmet. You, you've took me right. It's about 150. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's a bell helmet. Yeah. Star. yeah, I know what it is. Classic. I should do a video on that. They're worth a lot of money now. Yeah. So are you. I feel fucking too modern now. Let's do this then. I've got fags. We, we can have a smoke. Visor. You know these old visors? Yeah. It's two and a half mil thick. I could weld in this thing. <laughs> I could look, look at any clips. Right, so Paul is on his H1B, I think that one is. Kawasaki 500, triple two stroke. In the orange. Well, that's the nuts. Uh, we'll be doing a video on that bike soon. Listen to it, man. Look at it smoking. You look the nuts! Look how good that is. Look at him, his fucking Arnie boots, his Arnie jacket, that bell lid. It looks like a Lego <laughs> Is it Lego? Or what was it? Playmobil? He looks like a Playmobil man. Yeah, we're going up to somewhere called the Halfway House to meet his friends. Um, come out of London on the A12. Then it turns into the A127. That takes you all the way down to South End. South End, bruv. Yeah, it used to be a pub, I am not even don't even know if it is a pub here no, anymore, the halfway house, but we're going to go and meet his mate, and uh, yeah, look at the old suspension working on that, I thought it's going to pogo him off then. We are literally classic bike and modern bike. I love this monster, but you know I'd probably still rather be on the classic bike. You know, people ride new bikes today and they're like, Oh, I don't quite do this, don't quite do that. That's part of motorcycling, man. Every bike's got its own little bit of riding it, and that's what I love about bikes. They'll probably have more fun on that today than I will on this. Well, maybe. I might have a bit of a comfortable, easier ride. He looks fucking cool as fuck. <laughs> I wonder what Cliff is on. Let's meet Cliff and uh, 
him and Paul are like that. Like, well, we're, me and him are like that, but they're like that. Halfway out, here we are. Let's see what there is here. Oh, there's a few bikes here, look, today. Already there's a few bikes here. Yes, boys. Oh, so people do come up here and meet up here, I guess. Let's have a look at this. It looks so good. I feel like I was protecting you. I feel like I should be on a classic, really. We should be on an RGV or something. Yeah, an RGV would be nice. Right, so we're at the travel lodge, at the halfway house. We didn't stay the night, did we? <laughs> no, although we might have done. <laughs> Would have been, might have been all right. We've got another classic. Right. How was the ride? It's all right, <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> Just does that one, does what it says on the tin, just starts up and goes. All right, let's do it. We get the wheelies in, or is that like a bit of a problem? Do what you want. Number plate. <laughs> As everything's fucking registered to me. <laughs> <laughs> this, this sounds nothing compared to these. I need to get somewhere and get some fluid, man. So I think usually a lot of time there might be six of these out and about. Um, today they're all doing stuff. But we'll go down to a place, uh, I Beach. Um, a lot of bikers go around here. We'll have a cup of tea. Well, I'm gonna have something. I'm gonna have a Coke or something, man. I had a little bit of a late night. Uh, again. He can't help it doing wheelies on that, you know, that's what they do. Bit of shade, lovely. So, the air temperature at the minute it is only... Oh man, they got the glasses on. It's 28 degrees. It's half past 10 in the morning, it's 28 degrees. Which, some countries you're probably thinking, well, that's nothing, but 28 degrees at half 10 in the morning here is a lot. My eyes don't really work coming from the light to the dark like that. Shame there's a fucking car, as always. Straight across, bruv. Like these are really nice roads around here and stuff, but I don't know why they let cars on them. I think that place is a school. Oh look, old McDonald's farm, what we was talking about in the uh, Donington video. <laughs> you know, like, it is a hot day today and for the first time I felt a little bit of heat on the monster, you know? But I think you'd feel heat on anything today. Like, there's people driving along down here doing 15 mile an hour, do you know what I mean? Look at this. So now we're coming down to the secret nuclear bunker. Yeah, you'll see signs for it everywhere, even though it's secret. You do get a lot of bikes around here. Like 
are these sort of roads, this monster is fucking brilliant. If you ever come here, love a little bakery around there. Faden boys. This is such a nice bit of road when it's empty. It's got some nice up and down hill bits, nice bends. Like this bit here, you come like usually screaming into this bend, look, down the hill. Bike sort of sinks down up the hill over the crest bit here. Nice little bends around here. But again, all these car park people turn in, you need to make sure it's quiet when you're having a go down here. In fact, up this road, when we get over the other side of this roundabout, I had quite a crash down here once. I was on an RGV 250. I was on an RGV 250, and I was screaming long, got a tank slapper about 115 mile an hour uh, real bad that it was duh, 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 like stop to stop hit the curb uh, some guy was riding along he was doing about 90 and I overtook him through the forest it's safe to say that bike was uh, finished <laughs> well you're not indicating mate fucking prick yeah, it was down this road. I was like flat out down here. Coming the other way I was up, down, I mean, crashing on a straight bit of road, yeah? Yeah, and I still don't know how I managed to like, get from where I hit the curb through the forest and stuff, because as you can see, these forests are quite dense. How I managed to get through the forest. My bike went through the car park, come out the other side, I hit a tree. Yeah, man. I smashed that bike up. Look at these bikes, man, they're beautiful. That was alright, wasn't it? Yeah, it's easier. Right, so we stopped here, had a quick drink. Yeah, see you soon, mate. Yeah, yeah, mate. You what? <laughs> yeah, look, that's following you, look. I don't know what you mean. Probably soaked, my front tyre's probably soaked up in it. Neutral, that ain't ya? You? you ain't done that much. What's that? Changing them plugs. <laughs> that's what I'd like, mate. Yeah, what, that Mercedes? Look at that. Now that's a nuts. Look at that, 72 Mercedes, 72 Kawasaki. So Cliff's gone home, Paul's going home, I'm going home, I'm going to lay in the garden, lay in the paddling pool, have a barbecue. But yeah, what a nice day out with these boys riding around. I'm going left. Right, see you later. There he goes, he's off. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed coming out for a little ride with us and uh, seeing some of the places uh, around our area and where they go. We will be doing some videos on a lot of them classic bikes. Yeah, Monster's done well again today. As always guys, thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If this is the kind of thing you're into all things bikes, 
you may be thinking about hitting that subscribe button and uh, I'll see you again soon. Thanks very much for watching. Oh, we've had some fans in. We've had some fans in followers, here today. Followers. followers, yeah, let's yeah. say followers. Yeah, like we're a cult. Yeah, I feel like that, I must be like that geezer then. What, Charles Manson? No, we're not Charles Manson. Have you been hot today? It has been hot. How hot? Moist, I feel moist. Oh good, because I'll show you something. No, because we were talking about inventions the other day, weren't you? Yeah. <laughs> You're going to tell me you've invented something. <laughs> no, I've not invented something. you found an invention. Well, it's not mine, but I'll just... This is one I prefer... No, I'll get it, I'll get it. This you'll look at and you'll think, what is that? What do you think that is? It's something I don't want near me. Why? I'm not joking. These are so cool. Where did you get that? I was cooking dinner like this last night, it was so hot. Oh, they've got lights on them as well. You're not telling me. Just feel it, Paul, are you? You're Fucking hell. So I'm doing 60 miles an hour. That's cool. Of course you're down, isn't it? You can actually work. I could work, yeah, I'd probably just stand. <laughs> yeah. What do you think of that? That's great. Where'd you get it? I don't know. Asking. You're not telling me. I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? What about if you spray some water in? Now what's that? Don't oh no, no. You're you. lucky. I filled one with water the other day, but that's yeah, still kitchen cleaner. Done. Has it cooled you down? Yeah. Has it done what it's supposed to do? It's fantastic. That's, that is cool. I mean, it might be a bit weird walking down the road with these on. People wear all sorts of things. I could walk through the shop and see if anybody says, what the fuck is that band your neck? I feel hot without it now. Yeah, feel it. Put it, put it on again. I feel hot without it. Put it on again and angle it. Yeah, because you know like, even when you have a big blowy one indoors, it goes... Yeah, I've had a blowy indoors, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm going to buy another one and I'm going to fan assist my helmet. That is a good <laughs> idea. I'll cut a bit of the safety foam out of your crash helmet and wire them bits in. Make it less safe. Just comes with a little USB well, why charger. Have you, why have you waited all day to tell me about that then? Because I've been busy talking to so many people. I bet if we walk out there they all say, well we, we've got three options of what they're going to say. They're going to say, what the fuck is that round your neck you prick? Yeah. Where did you get that from? You prick. Or get me one of them. You prick. Why do I have to have you prick on every answer? that's what they like here, isn't it? <laughs>